Hi everyone, welcome to India Food Recipes Dirty. Today I am going to make Vatta Kolambu, it is Puli Kolambu. Uh, it is a very famous South Indian uh, curry. Let us see the ingredients. Uh, 1 cup of turmeric extract, 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds, 1 teaspoon of uh, Bengal gram and 3 dry chillies and uh, 1 cup of uh, sesame oil nalane, and uh, 1 teaspoon of asafoetida and some curry leaves uh, 1 teaspoon of uh, turmeric powder half a teaspoon of methi seeds fenugreek seeds and um, a pinch of uh, jangri vellum and 1 teaspoon of salt and uh, 3 teaspoon of sambar powder and I'm going to use some Midhiku Vattal um, you have some Manatakali or Sundakai Vattal you can use that those things uh, that's it let us see how to prepare this Vatta Kolambu heat the oil in the pan make sure oil is heat first I'm going to add uh, 1 teaspoon of uh, mustard seeds and 1 teaspoon of fenugreek seeds and 1 teaspoon of bengal gram karale purple and I am going to add curry leaves and dry chilies In between, I am going to add this uh, uh, vattal. Suppose you don't have a vattal, you can use some vegetable like say, drumstick, a brinjal, uh, okra, whatever vegetable do you want, you can use those vegetables. If you use more oil, that is sesame oil, you can keep this colombo for at least uh, uh, 5 to 6 days. The sesame oil will give nice taste to the puli colombo. That's why I am using 1 cup of sesame oil. Stir it well until they get slightly brown color. Suppose if you are using manatakali vatal, it's very good for our stomach. It will cure any kind of stomach wounds. Now I am going to add uh, uh, 3 teaspoon of sambar powder. This is the main ingredient of this uh, puli colombo. Stir it well until they move the raw smell uh, of the sambar powder and vattal. Uh, Stir it continuously. This is a very tasty uh, recipe, South Indian recipe. Now I am going to add uh, 1 teaspoon of asafoetida. This is a very good digestion agent. If you are using more asafoetida, you can get nice smell. That's why I am using it. Stir it. Now I am going to add uh, turmeric powder again stir this mixture well now I am going to pour our turmeric extract the main ingredient if you are using a small onion you can get nice taste instead of big onion small onion will give nice taste Stir it well. This is a very quick recipe also. Now I am going to add a half a teaspoon of salt. How much you, can, you want you can add that much amount. Stir it well. Allow it to cook for at least 10 minutes until we get a thick gravy. After that we will add that, that jangri part. Can you see this? We are getting thick gravy of 
butter colombo now i'm going to add a pinch of like this uh, zangri that is vellam don't add sugar because this zangri only give nice taste to our vata colombo you can keep this vata colombo for uh, around uh, five to uh, six days uh, because of sesame oil suppose if you are using a small onion or um, okra brinjal and drumstick uh, uh, this also good yeah our yummy vata colombo is ready now i am going to turn off the flame try it yourself send your valuable commands to www.indiafoodrecipes13 we will meet next video thank you